I really love that. We've always talked about taking this um, things offline to online to offline to online, just doing that full circle because, um, you know, I think there's a lot of people out there who just focus on the online. You know, they spend all this time trying to understand their customers, um, you know, what's happening online, behavior through analytics. And, you know, using Passkit, we, we do a lot of um, analytics on our side to see how passes are redeemed and where people are, um, uh, where it's issued and whatnot. But um, I think uh, the biggest thing with the beacons is you, you, it's not just understanding your customers, but because once you understand them, you can actually drive actions, right? That's what we're looking for. Um, some call to action, some simple action that's taken by the consumer to drive them for a, a specific purpose. Um, and you know, there's a lot of other interesting features uh, about the beacons. And, but I think for me, that's the, 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 the thing that really pops out for me because you're, you're driving real people to do something at a location. Exactly. Yeah. That reminds me of that uh, example that Nick was talking about before, about a VIP in a hotel room. He then goes downstairs to the lobby and then decides to go to a, go to a bar, and he's immediately, because he has that app installed in his phone, he's immediately presented with a coupon for a drink direct to his lock screen. Now, this experience cannot be done with any other uh, kind of technology. It's just precisely proximity marketing, having that app installed, knowing where that user is, presenting them with a timely, relevant, and valuable message, in this case, a coupon, which then pretty much ties in the whole user experience and allows for, encourages the consumer to actually take action and spend. Yeah. Well, I mean, I wish I had more experiences like that when I walk in the store, but I guess um, I'm not a <laughs> VIP anywhere as not of yet. Not yet, not <laughs> yet.